Uh, Lee, a very impressive and very entertaining opening press conference from uh, Derby County's new head coach, Paul Warren. What, what did you make of it? It was possibly one of the best press conferences I've ever been to in terms of a manager unveiling. I thought he spoke honestly, really engaging, funny, um, but obviously a man full of ambition as well. I thought the way he spoke about the football club, its ambitions, its long-term strategy. I think you know the fans are going to be in for a, a really um, interesting ride. He seems to be a very normal man, doesn't he? Well, this is a thing. I spoke to um, Matt Palmer, who played under Paul at, at Rotherham and won promotion with him, actually, after, after, about six months after he joined the club. And we were talking about what kind of makes Paul tick. And he basically said that you know, it's been so refreshing to find somebody in football who doesn't get caught up in how intense and how serious it is. And actually, like players and like ourselves just normal people basically at the end of the day you just want to be treated right for, right, and being treated with respect so and I perhaps I think maybe that's probably partly reasons why he's been so successful because I think players can relate to him you know he wants to know about what's going on in their lives know about their family what makes them tick as people their inspirations and I think sometimes that football does get a little bit too serious and we forget that players are ultimately, like everybody else, have those human relationships to look after, friends, family, you know. So, yeah, I think he's, uh, I think he's going to be a very good fit for, for Derby and what they stand for. Any moment, any answer that, that really stood out from all of that? Well, I was a bit surprised when he said he nearly died in the last couple of days when he said he went for a run. Was it Lockwood Road, was it? Um, so, yeah, that one threw me, a bit, threw me a little bit. But I think that's the kind of guy he is. I think he's just going to, you ask him a question, he'll always get an honest answer. But I I think, you know, he's, he's talking about Ted Lasso. I think, you know, it gives us a better understanding of what he's like as a person. So, yeah, I think for, it was an hour, seven minutes, because I looked at me, phone but um where I was recording but what an hour seven minutes was it was it, it seemed to go as quick as a flash so and that's credit to him because you, you you're sort of buying into it to what he's saying and I can see why he has been so successful as he is because he, he's so engaging uh, and he comes into a better situation than, than a lot of new managers do when, when they take over clubs sometimes what, what do you think will be the, the sort of the first thing on, on the to-do list for him yeah it's funny because I was asked to write a piece about this last week I, I think that the the, the the, the one thing that strikes me about this season, the one thing that the fans are, are desperate to see is an improvement in the away form, I think. And that's not just this season, to be fair, that stretches back into the Championship. Well, I think three wins out of the last 36 league games away from home for a club of Derby size and stature, that record does really need a lot of improvement. So I think that will be high up on the agenda and he's got obviously a chance to do that against Cambridge at the weekend. And we've seen how tough it has been for Derby away from home already this season. Lincoln, Fleetwood, Shrewsbury, you know, there's such a, such a big club and got such a good squad that a lot of teams know that they can't match the individual quality so they'll do what Lincoln did which is they'll just try and run you off the park and that's something I think that that Paul's perhaps got to, uh, to have a look at in the, in the weeks coming forward so that for me is probably the biggest issue he's got to address.